And a new poll in the U.S. Senate race today shows Republican Sharon Engel opening up a narrow lead over Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid. The survey of 1,000 likely voters was conducted by Pulse Opinion Research for Fox News. 49% said they would choose Sharon Engel. Harry Reid trails behind her with 46% support, and 4% say they would choose some other candidate. Surprisingly, 0% were undecided in this poll. you got Sharon Angle now running ahead of Harry Reid right. again. And in the Nevada Senate race, Republican and Tea Party favorite Sharon Angle now leads Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid by three points. The latest poll shows the race for U.S. Senate in Nevada is still tight, but the lead has changed hands again. Republican Sharon Angle now leads Senator Harry Reid by three points in the Fox Rasmussen poll. Experts say Reid needs to go into the election with a lead or risk having the undecideds vote heavily against him. Let's start in uh, Nevada, Britt, and this race is really uh, heating up, obviously. You have Sharon Angle, the Republican out there, with a lead in the latest Fox poll. It's a lead 49 percent to Senate Majority Leader Harry Reid's 46 percent. That is within the margin of error. What strikes you about this well, poll? Well, I think the most interesting number there may be the one, none of the above, one percent. And I'll explain in just a moment why 1% of uh, none of the above is important. Harry Reid is disapproved of, as you can see, by 56% of the voters. And the same number, when asked the question, has he been in office too long? The same number, here it is, 56 to 40% say yes, indeed he has. So let's go now, back to the first poll. Let's go back poll. to 1%. Now, the option, no one, none of the above, is actually on the ballot in Nevada. And so somebody was, can walk in and say, in and not say, Harry Reid, not... Yeah, they're mad, they, may, they may not like Reid, they may not angle, like Angle, they're going to vote for none of the above. That was thought that a real threat to Angle's candidacy. But with the, the, the number of that is down to 1%. So that may be the key number, and it may mean that even though her lead is within the margin of error, one of the biggest threats to her campaign has been re removed if, if this undecided factor or none of the above factor has, has, uh, has subsided almost to nothing.